Hello everyone, welcome back. In previous session, we have discussed about the flexibility and stiffness. So, in today's session, we are going to discuss about flexibility matrix method and stiffness matrix method with their generalized coordinate systems. On your screen, you can see flexibility matrix method. The systematic development of consistent deformation method in the matrix form has led to flexibility matrix method. Consistent deformation method ka development matrix form mein bana hai flexibility matrix method. In this method, basic unknowns are redundant forces. Isme to basic unknown hote hai, hote redundant forces. Hence, the analyst has to first identify basic determinate structure and thereby identify redundant forces. So, analyst ko sabse pehle identify karna padta hai basic determinate structure ko aur uske baad wo identify karta hai redundant forces ko. See, the number of redundant forces is equal to degree of static indeterminacy. The number of redundant forces hote hai, wo equal hote hai degree of static indeterminacy ke. That is displacements in basic determinate structure due to given loading and redundant forces are found and the consistency conditions are formed. So, determinate structure mein jo displacement hota hai kisi loading ke dwara wo redundant forces ko found kiya jata hai aur usse consistency conditions form ki jati hai. The resulting simultaneous equations are solved to get redundant forces. Resulting simultaneous equations ko solve kiya jata hai jisse redundant forces mil jayen. Then the required quantities at any sections are calculated. The required quantity tick kisi section pe calculate ki jati hai. The equations developed are in matrix form. Jo equation develop hoti hai, usse rakhte hai matrix form mein. Since computers can be used for solving simultaneous equations, there is no limit for the number of equations that can be handled. Computer simultaneous equations ko solve kar sakta hai. So, number of equations ko handle karne ki isme limit nahi hoti. This method is all known as the force flexibility as compatibility method. Isi method ko force method bhi kehte hai, flexibility method bhi kehte hai and compatibility method bhi kehte hai. Now, stiffness matrix method. The systematic development of slope diffraction method in the matrix form has given rise to stiffness matrix method. Slope diffraction method ka systematic development hi matrix form mein bana stiffness matrix method. In this method, the basic unknowns are displacement of joints. This method of basic unknown hote hote hai jointly displacement. The equations of equilibrium are formed and solved to get slope and deflection at the joints. So equilibrium equations ko form ke jati hai aur unse solve ke jata hai jisse hume joint pe slope deflection mil jaye. Using these moments and shear forces are calculated. This method is known as stiffness matrix displacement or equilibrium method. So unko use karke hume shear force and moments calculate ki jati hai. Isi method ko kehte hain stiffness matrix method. Displacement method or equilibrium method. Now generalize coordinate systems. The meaning of coordinate system in matrix methods of structural analysis is different from the Cartesian or polar coordinate system. Means matrix method of coordinate system alag hota hai Cartesian or polar coordinate system se. The direction of force or displacement to determine the structural system are known as generalized coordinates. Forces of displacement ki direction jo hume structural system ko determine karayengi usse bolte hain generalized coordinates for example in the analysis of single by single story frame the coordinates selected are as shown in figure in this case the displacement vector and force vectors are given by for example single by single story frame ki analysis karni hai displacement vector delta is equals to theta b theta c sway and aapko jo force vector aapne select kiya wo hai mb mc and sway force see the diagram आपने डायरेक्शन सेलेक्ट किया है वन टू एंड थ्री सो आपको ए बी सी डी कोई फ्रेम है इसे आपका शो कर रखा है सोए सोए इट इज द जनरलाइज कोर्नेट्स इन स्टिफनेस मैट्रिक्स अप्रोच नाउ फॉर फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी मैट्रिक्स मेथड इन द एनालिसिस ऑफ सिंगल बाय सिंगल स्टोरेज फ्रेम शोन इन फिगर द कोऑर्डिनेट्स सेलेक्टेड आर वन टू एंड थ्री द रेडिएंट फोर्सेस वेक्टर पी एंड डिस्प्लेसमेंट वेक्टर डेल्टा इज गिवन बाय नो पी है हमारा वी टी एस डी एंड एम डी and delta hai delta vd delta sd and theta d see the diagram abcd aapka frame hai coordinate aapne select kiya hai 1 2 and 3 so this is the generate coordinates in flexibility matrix approach in matrix analysis force means force as well as moments depending upon the coordinate directions means coordinate direction mein depend karta hai force ka matlab force bhi hota hai force ka matlab matrix analysis mein moments bhi hota hai similarly displacement means deflection as well as rotation 
सिमिलरली डिस्प्लेसमेंट का मतलब डिफ्लेक्शन भी होता है डिस्प्लेसमेंट का मतलब रोटेशन भी होता है एट द एंड आई वॉन्ट टू सजेस्ट यू स्टे सेफ स्टे स्ट्रॉन्ग एंड स्टे पॉजिटिव सब्सक्राइब कीजिए सिविल ज्ञानी चैनल को और बेल आइकन को दबाइए सिविल इंजीनियरिंग लेक्चर वीडियो सबसे पहले देखने के लिए अगर आपको वीडियो पसंद आई हो तो लाइक कीजिए अपने डाउट्स और सजेशन को कमेंट बॉक्स में लिखिए और शेयर कीजिए वीडियो अपने दोस्तों के साथ